What's up, wrestling fans, trading card collectors? Welcome to another episode of Wrestling with Cards. Today, we're looking at the WCW Thunder Card Game Wrestling Cards set. This is kind of something weird I just ran across. It was cheap. Figured I'd pick it up since I'd never seen it before, and I'm always on the hunt for obscure wrestling cards. This game was released in 1999. You'll be able to see that by the characters and their style represented on the cards when I go through the cards briefly. It's released by the United States Playing Card Company. Based on my research, rules of the game are kind of a hybrid between card games such as War and Slapjack. The game, for the most part, has gotten really bad reviews. So here's just some of the base gameplay based on the rules I'm reading. So these are your action cards. You would have a hand of wrestling cards. Each player would put them down, and then you would reveal the wrestling cards. Okay, so here's Nash with a triangle, Sting with a blue circle, triangle wins, so Nash would get that. So here's a blue thunder card. Not only does this match, but if I remember right, if you get the thunder card, you can keep this in your hand and then you can use it later on and you somehow win automatically. There's also some kind of game mechanic where you can slap the thunder logo or something if there's a tie. I just kind of briefly ran over the instructions. If you want more instructions, you can probably find those online. But that's just a base layout of how the gameplay works. One of the coolest things about this card set, in my opinion, is this sweet carrying case. Included with a Velcro belt loop. Because who doesn't want to walk down the street with this thing strapped to your hip, ready to whip it out and play some thunder wrestling card games at any given moment for anybody that challenges you for the championship. You know what else would be awesome is if you could wear this on your belt loop, on your hip, in conjunction with a Yu-Gi-Oh! dual disc on your arm. Talk about awesome. Talk about being a check magnet. So let's run through these cards. You've got your official rules. You've got your action deck. So these are the shapes, colors that you want to try to match your wrestlers to. But then this is why we're all here for the wrestler cards. All right, so there's three, I believe, yeah, three cards per character. So we've got Kevin Nash, Wolfpack Kevin Nash, Sting, Macho Man. Looks like is ready to work on his rap CD right there. Scott Steiner, Big Papa Pump. As you can tell, most of these are from 1999, 2000 era. Disco Inferno, that's the most randomly inserted character. I know a lot of people that love Disco, but would you think he was a top star in 99 to put in a card set of WCW? I don't know. That's debatable. Let me know in the comments. What do you think about Disco Inferno? Are you a huge fan? Do you think somebody else should have been put in this game? I don't know. Conan... Which is weird. This is like NWO kind of Dungeons of Doom look. And then this is more like Wolfpack look. Or is it Filthy Animals? Is that the group he was in? Ran in 99-2000. Diamond Dallas Page. That's a good pose right there. That's probably one of my favorite cards in the set. Bret Hart with two poses that are almost identical. Goldberg. Lex Luger. These are some interesting Hogan cards. This is after the NWO Hollywood. He went back to Hulkster, Hulkamania, Hulk Hogan. So that's kind of a cool little tidbit history. And then Benoit. Nothing fancy about that. So that's it for the 1999 WCW Thunder trading card game. Did you have this game? Have you ever played this game? Let me know in the comments what you think of this game. Thoughts, opinions on the photography used on the cards, the wrestlers. Did you like Disco Inferno, like I said earlier? Let me know in the comments. While you're there, make sure to check out all the links to social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. If you like this video and you like wrestling, training cards, make sure to subscribe. I'm going to keep putting out the content for you guys, hopefully, and keep you entertained. If you want to support the show, check out my storefronts for eBay, Mercari, and check out my cards. And until next time, see you, wrestling fans.